the coalition. I'm guilty. It's been six months, and he's still nowhere to be found. I just can't wrap my head around Dad just leaving and staying and going like this. With no contact at all. I just don't understand. Well, you know, he deserves some time away after dealing with my shenanigans. <sighs> he's been dealing with her shenanigans for over 40 years. Why will he leave now? Well, how about this? Maybe he's got him a little young thing. That's not funny, Grace. Yes, it is funny. After 45 years, he deserves some R&R &R now. Well, I'm worried about him. He's been gone for a few days, a week at the most. The police, they even gave up searching for Dad. Maybe we should, too. You stop. He could be hurt somewhere. Or even worse. Sad. Celebration time, come on. It's a celebration time, come on. Don't get quiet because I came into the room. It's a celebration. <laughs> 45 years of marriage. Happy anniversary, Harry. What happened to the music? I want to celebrate with my husband. <laughs> Harry. I don't think you're ready for this jelly. Get ready for this jelly. Mama, you shouldn't be drinking like this. Mercy. I am a grown woman. Yes, ma'am. And therefore, I can do what the hell I want. I'm sorry. And right now, I'm sorry. no, no, no. I'm going to turn it up. That's right. Turn on up. Turn up, Mama. Grace, why are you acting like your father's not missing? Now's not the time. But mama, you said you were- I don't care. David. Come give your mama a hug, baby. Damn, give mama a hug. <laughs> you know I love you, right? You okay, baby? You need anything? No, Mama, I'm good. Are you okay? So sweet. I'm good, baby. Just as long as I got my baby boy. I am good. Okay. I'm getting ready to go up to my room and listen to some music and relax. When your father gets home, Tell him he can sleep on the couch. Wow. 
Yeah, she done gone and lost it. She done lost it all. But you know what? She haven't lost it so much that she forgets to love on her baby, David. Don't start, Grant. Have you told her yet? No, he haven't told her. He's scared straight. But you know what? We all gonna find out. We're gonna find out soon enough. And she is taking forever. I hope she's not getting cold feet, bro. And she's good, bro. Alexia always comes through. Yeah, you right. I'm really worried about Pops, though. I know he travel a lot for work, but it's been about six months. That is crazy. Yeah, he'll pop back up, man. <laughs> You know, he's probably off with his other family. Bro, stop playing like that. You know this situation is killing mom and you coming with these conspiracy theories? Man, look, dad had a bunch of secrets, man. But look, Alexia is going to help us uncover the truth. She just got to get this paperwork. Look, here she comes now. Good, Lex? Yep. You know what? That's what we need. This whole thing has us at odds. I don't know what to do. I told you it wasn't a good idea. Whatever. I'll figure this out. Good luck and I'm gonna sign off. actually did that you're such a goofball it was so much fun though the look of those old lady faces were priceless yeah because you moved them you jerk let me kick me with your feet It's my dad. I don't think my dad just up and left. Didn't you say all of his clothes and things were gone, though? Yeah.
I know who you are, Harry. How can I help you? Harry Hawkins. And who are you? Who are you? You came to my door. Yes, I did. It's not the first time I've traced Harry's whereabouts to your front door. You can have him. to tell you. Good baby. I got engaged. You got what? You got engaged? You got engaged to who? Her name is Alexia. You got engaged to a woman your mama don't even know. Mama, she's perfect. I don't want, I don't want your David. Say. What do I want you to say? This was not the plan, Lex. Look, whose side are you on? That's, that's not fair. Life's not fair. You knew what the original plan was. And as soon as we get this close to closing the deal, you will often get engaged to this dude? Closing the deal? I don't even know what that means, Apollo. Look, I did my job. I got you the information you needed. You're supposed to be my best friend. I'd be happy for you, but guess not. Can you just take me back to my car? I don't trust him, bro. I just got a real bad feeling about him. Don't even run that one time. You know her for all of what, six months? You about to marry her? Or are you tweaking? Man, I know. But she really makes me happy. Happy? Bro, marriage is about more than just your happiness. It's a real commitment. We both can attest to that. Look at your parents. Yeah, that's true. But you gotta trust me on this one, man. I know it sounds crazy, but I love Alexia. She genuinely makes me a better person. All right. That's what you like. You just make sure you know who she really is. People be out here living lives, bro. That's all I'm saying. Love you. You were right, Grace. Dad wasn't planning on leaving us a dime. Exactly. I 
to miss him, though. He was such a jokester. Yeah, with you, you could do no wrong. He was always on me. You never wanted to follow the rules. Whatever. So how's the plan coming along? The plan's coming along. Man, this ain't right, bro. What you gonna do me like that? What you gonna do, kill your own brother, Apollo? Shut up, shut up! <sighs> Apollo, are you okay? All right, man. Like I told you, I got a plan. Yeah, you keep saying that. Life can be stolen. Life can be taken. Souls are lost. Because nothing is sacred. Harry's soul was lost. He was a rich, unfaithful, but sinful married man. Blinding me with money and fancy circumstance. Lying to my face. We have two sons. I thought your love was true. All that hustling got you killed, Harry. You can't blame nobody but you. Muddy, greenbacks, the dollar bill, money, 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 money. That's all you ever loved, Harry. You love the power and you love the control that you thought you had on everybody. Everybody, Harry. Even me, even me, Harry, you bastard. <laughs> it's okay. That's okay. Because Dave is going to be all right even if you're not his father. He's gonna be all right. Something's not right with my brother. I mean, I seen hate and violence in Apollo's eyes yesterday, Alexia. I thought we were done. I want more from life than this, Lance. I don't want to hurt anybody. Me either, sis. We have to stop Apollo before he does something stupid. Look, I know we owe you money. 
I haven't seen him in months. I understand. I promise we will pay you back. Please, just give us more time. Are you okay? I'm fine. You look afraid. What is really going on? And I want the truth. Stop! Just stop lying to me. Have you taken your medication today? You're gonna have to kill him. That's the only way to fix this situation. Apollo. Mom, are you okay? I don't know. Your father really hurt me. And I allowed it. I allowed it for years. Don't blame yourself, Mom. What Dad did was wrong, flat out. Yes, but I allowed it. I tried from the truth because that man took care of us. Harry was a great provider. But he was also an habitual liar. Where's Apollo? I'm worried about Apollo, Mama. So am I. Lance. I heard Apollo on the phone talking to somebody about it. He thought I was asleep. I'm really worried about that boy. There's a dark spirit on him. So you think Apollo has something to do with Dad's disappearance? Unfortunately, I do. I couldn't hear everything he was saying. But I heard him mention having to bury somebody. You think Apollo killed Dad? Yes, baby. I do. You told me and Mama he was already dead. Well, he wasn't. What do you mean? Well, he wasn't. You said you had him buried in order to protect mama. Oh my God. What did I, oh my God, what did I do? What did I do? Oh my God, Grace, what did we do? We were wrong. Grace? Hey, I don't want to hear that. What's done is done. We got to get paid, right? Right? Look, you're not so innocent. You and that husband of yours, I know y'all owe some dangerous people. So suck it up. And besides, he was barely breathing. We had to finish him off. Look, all we gotta do is tip the cops off so they find the body and we get the insurance money. Mama doesn't want to. She feels guilty for pushing daddy down the stairs. Well, it seems like we need to play some hardball with mama. Oh my God. Hey, I need to talk to you. You got nothing to say to you, Grace. Why are you so mad at me? I'm the one that helped you commit murder. I didn't murder your father. Well, why was it so easy for you to allow me to dump his body when all you had to do was call the police? It was an accident. Your father and I were arguing over David. I became frustrated and I pushed him. Well, I didn't mom, know he was going. I did not know he was going to fall down the stairs. Unfortunately, mom, 
That's considered murder? And anyway, what did Dad say about David to make you want to kill him? I did. Grace, just get out of my room. No! We're going to talk about this situation. Look, Mom, all we need to do is drop an anonymous tip to the cops. They find Dad's body. Boom. We collect the insurance money. Is that all you think about, the money? Mom, come on. Don't play that role with me. I don't need that damn money. Well, Mercy and I do. No, you leave Mercy out of this. See, there we go again. She can never do any wrong. She's always been your favorite. Well, you need to have a talk with your favorite daughter. She owes some bad people. And something tells me they're about to collect what's due. One way or the other. Hmm. You know what? Maybe I should turn Dad's murder in. That's right. I'll turn Dad's murder in. Get out of my damn room. Get out of my damn room. Get the hell out of my room! That's what I saw, Dave. Why are you always making up stuff? What did Alexia ever do to you? Bro, I'm not lying. We've been friends since grade school. Have I ever hated on you like that? Man, shut up! Hey, man, you need to calm down. I said shut up! Quit fucking lying on my girl! Stop lying! Stop lying! Stop fucking lying! Bro, you been taking your meds? Yes. And I really love Alexia. I just want you to quit talking about her. Okay. How about we just go check in on your moms? I know it's a lot going on right now and she can use our support. Cool? Okay. All right, let's go. Does God really forgive us for our sins? Or has he already cursed humanity? Are the deadly diseases, mass murders, corrupt governments, and deadly natural disasters God's way of punishing us? What if God wasn't this all-loving and forgiving entity? What if God hated us for the evil we spread throughout the world? What if God hates me? God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the lies. I'm sorry for the things we stole. Plants and applaud. We've been thieves. We con people and ruin people's lives. I don't want to be that person anymore, God. If you still love me, please save me! There's no more loyalty left in the world. There's no one left to truly trust. God already left us in hell. So I'm gonna raise it. Not even his son. But you too share his fate. good enough? I mean, did you really need a second family? I mean, you had mom, Apollo, and me. Man, we supported you no matter what. You know, I never heard mom complain one time about your little business trips. You were who I wanted to be. A great father. A great supporter, just like you. 
Now I'm looking like a fool. You ain't my damn hero. What's up? I need your help. So now you need my help. Just let me in. I don't know what's going on with David. He hasn't been himself at all lately. He just lost it on me after I asked him why he wasn't answering his phone. He was screaming and shouting at me. Apollo, he was a totally different person. It was really scary. Hmm. So your fiance isn't the man you thought he was. Funny. I'm pretty sure your best friend tried to tell you that. But at the moment, you got angry with your best friend and shunned him. Just, just stop, Apollo. So what do you want me to do? I don't know. Look, sis. How about I go over there with you so you can talk to him? I don't know about that. Look, I'll stay in the car. I just want you to be able to have a nice conversation with him in a safe manner. After finding out that he's your half-brother, I don't know if that's the best idea. Uh, look, look, it's okay. All right, it's not even about that. Look, I'm just looking out for you. Okay, fine. But please just stay in the car. I got you. Hey, uh, let me put this down and grab my stuff. Okay. Hey, Mom. Do you think Dad thought Apollo and I wasn't good enough for him? I mean, we did challenge his authority and we were a little unruly, but... Don't you maybe... dare blame yourself for your father's actions. I've been thinking about it. And besides making the other family out to be our enemies, maybe we need to connect with them to see what's going on. Maybe we just need to go over there and talk to him. I mean, it'll be cool to get to know him. When we go tonight? Tonight? Now is a better time than any. What's the point in waiting? That's true. Let's go, Mama. Okay. Baby, I know you miss your father. And you've been going through a lot lately. David, baby, you gotta take your medicine. You hear me? Look, I'm sorry that I got upset with you when you told me about your engagement. But I was just upset because you didn't tell me anything about her. So, okay, let's not have any more secrets, okay? Um, well, why don't you tell him the truth? And stop babying him. The truth about what? Grace, this is not the time for that. Grace, why are you getting so conniving? Your brother need our support. We all need your support, Mom. Grace, let's not. Let's. I'm tired of running from confrontation. Maybe you don't have the heart, but I do. Grace, we're gonna you, stop. Why are you so insensitive? And why are you so full of shit? And who the hell you think you talking to? I'm not talking to? to you. Don't you talk to Mama like that. Look, let's just calm down. Shut up. Everybody shut up and stop it. Stop lying to me. Stop fucking lying to me. Stop fucking lying to me. Stop. 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 David, calm down, bro. It's okay. Don't tell me it's going to be okay. Where is my dad? I know y'all been lying to me. 
I don't need no medicine to tell me that I'm crazy. Tell me the truth. Mom. Mercy. Grace. Okay. Why don't you ask your mom? Especially after what she done to him. David. Yo, David. 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 Hey, yo, David. No! The Coalition of Beauty.